down there. It's cool. These are pretty thick lava flows, actually, too. Yeah. Right? yeah. They're all about the same, though, thickness, aren't they? Yeah, yeah they're, uh, these here are all about two and a half meters, three meters thick. <clears throat> And of course, they very much ponded in valleys and sort of, you can see where yeah. they're going over slopes, right. the slopes here. And you can see uh, this one up here, is, it's, it's chopped that off oh, yeah. there. Yeah. And the you know, flow has gone down into the valley down here. Valley. And that's what uh, Chris, one of our grad students was, um, Followed up on a lot of the work. Is this okay, Val? I'm not disturbing you too much. Uh, a lot of the work that Tom Sissons and uh, colleagues did on the uh, U.S. Um, uh, Rainier and Adams and so on was on uh, sub ice eruptions. And okay. You get the same here. Same thing. Oh, you think these have interacted with water? Some of them have. Some of them have. Yes. But glaciers. Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah. Yes. And uh, the, the, the best effects are actually over on the other side of the volcano. It's oh. a long walk to it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Half a day. Oh, where are we? 